Yeah. yeah, definitely. There's a cop running. Clearly, something was off. An officer racing down the sidewalk, tossing a spike belt into the path of an oncoming fire truck. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> All a frantic attempt to stop the driver behind the wheel. Someone hijacked. <laughs> Police say it began in the city's northeast, that a man stole the truck during a medical call, hit a vehicle and downed a hydro pole. I mean, there's sparks flying everywhere. Mark and, uh, Reimer was there and says lines, he feels so. lucky he didn't get hit. I'm just really confused. I mean, what kind of person does that? Police say the truck then headed downtown, plowing into this park, swerving near people, and at one point getting stuck near a mall. Something immediately was not right. I noticed that the front end of the fire truck was a little bit banged up, as well as the sides. Authorization was given that we would not be aborting this pursuit given the extreme risk to the public. Um, the threat was very real here. Eventually, police say the truck came to a halt under this bridge. And you can see some of that extensive damage to the front of the truck and the front right wheel. And then they add that they had to subdue the suspect using a taser. Fire officials say it's typical to keep trucks running in the winter and are looking into how exactly this one got stolen. Meanwhile, a man is in custody and police say it's shocking no one was seriously hurt. Angela Johnston, CBC News, Winnipeg.